So the research that I do involves trying to understand what happened in the past. Archaeologists are interested in trying to maximise recovery of evidence. It's only by recovering all the different types of evidence from an archaeological site can we begin to get a fuller picture about what happened to people in the past. That's exactly the same as what a forensic scientist is trying to do. They're trying to maximise the, maximise the recovery of evidence so that they can understand what happened in and around the time of somebody's death. And so archaeologists have got skills in accurate recording the location of remains, of systematically recovering evidence so that nothing is missed. We will sieve soil, for example, to make sure that we get the smallest traces of remains and we can build up our picture of the past. And those skills are incredibly important in a crime scene. You do not want to miss any evidence that could link a victim or a perpetrator at a crime scene because any kind of evidence that you miss may mean you cannot secure a conviction. So once you've recovered the body, you've brought it back to the laboratory, there is a whole range of different information you can extract from the skeleton. Archaeologists are also very good at looking at trauma and trying to work out whether the trauma that's been sustained to a body, to a skeleton, occurred before death, occurred around the time of death, or it occurred after death, perhaps during burial and deposition. So we can, we can work out that, and that's really important in trying to understand what happened at a crime scene, to try and reconstruct those last few hours, last few minutes in a person's life, uh, and, and try and work out and develop a story about what happened to that individual. The reason that I love forensic archaeology and the reason I, I am so passionate about teaching it is because it demonstrates the contemporary relevance of archaeological practice in, in a very clear way. It shows how archaeology is about understanding what happened in the past and it is about understanding the lives of communities and individuals in the past and the way in which they lived. And, and that is utterly fascinating. But also to be able to have, uh, offer something to contemporary society in terms of something beneficial in terms of excavating mass graves, for example, and being able to repatriate bodies with families to ensure closure, to ensure that, that justice is pursued. That's incredibly important, and I think it's, it just demonstrates what a, what a versatile and fascinating discipline that archaeology is.